I'll lay low until you're finished. Can we leave this place yet? I don't like it. Ready now? Yes. Let's head out for the dreadful whale. What happened? Hypatia was the crown killer. <laughs> That's impossible. Duke tricked her into injecting herself with a flawed version of her serum. It changed her, but there was an antidote, so she'll live. If she remembers the murders, she'll have to deal with that. And Sokolov? He's been moved to the house of a man named Kieran Jindosh. The Duke's grand inventor. Supposedly brilliant. Another genius. Just what we needed. I need Anton Sokolov, but he's missing. Held by another inventor named Kieran Jindosh, who no doubt wants whatever secret Sokolov holds in his head. Jindosh is the mad inventor who brought clockwork killing machines to Karnaka. They say he's got the most brilliant mind in the Isles. And it may be true, but a smart man wouldn't be standing in my way. I've got to find out where Sokolov's being held and bring the old man back alive. Rescue one genius and kill the other before he creates an army of clockwork soldiers. Sokolov. He might be the key to unraveling the Duke's plans. My memories are disjointed. The Duke is close to his grand inventor, Kirin Jindosh. But that man has the empathy of a mantis. He seems to both admire and despise Sokolov. We visited Aramis Stilton. I liked him. But... Something bad happened. Just snatches a memory. Sorry. You should rest easy for a while. Maybe some of that will help. I hope so. I'm not sure I even fully understand what you did for me. But I owe you for helping me at Adamire. Thank you. Megan must be up on deck.
Let's hope your friend doesn't sink the boat while we're gone. Ready? We should head out. All right, let's get underway. Jindosh is important to the Duke's inner circle. The Grand Guard watches his mansion, harassing people who look like trouble. You said there's a wall of light cutting off access to the carriage station. Yes, but there's a black market shop nearby. They sell on the sly. Ever use a rewiring tool? Yes, but it's been years. Good. Get past the wall of light. Then ride the carriage to where Jindosh lives. And there's a reason people are afraid of his mansion. I'll see you after it's done. Corbo, take care of this crazy man and his clockwork soldiers, then bring Sokolov back. He means a lot to me. I thought about leaving this place. There's someone there? Careful with that sword. The Grand Guard won't like it. Drag us down. Where are you? This can't be! It's a hole! The paper is dead! like that. Jindosh worked for three months, 
and built a machine composed of wood, brass, and the bones of several cats. It ran on a few drops of whale oil a day. The little girl was told she would have a special treat, and she was perfectly delighted until the moment it was activated. She lives in an asylum up at Dabakfa now, and will until the end of her days.